You lose your head at the slightest provocation, and with it the ability to make the simplest decision. It's hard to say whether you would be any help at all. How dare you! Zhong Hui, that's extremely rude. Forgive me. I only said what I did because you are trying to get out of the battle, my lord. I have certain connections with the Emperor. If you would like, I could have a word with him and encourage him to allow you to go to Duanggu. Master Zhao, I know this is not how you like to do things, but perhaps you should accept Master John Hui's offer. Yes, I think I should. Thank you, Zhang Wei. I am most grateful for the wise decision you have made. We will head to Duanggu first, where we will wait for you to join us. Come, Master Deng Ai. Listen, Jugo Dun. I have another task I would like you to help me with. The land of Shochun is currently beset with persistent rebellion. The people there have great respect for you. I would like you to restore the peace there. I... Cho Chun lies on the border between Wei and Wu. This task will also make you responsible for dealing with Wu. I need you to do this, Jugo Dun. You're the only one I trust. I must admit that I was insulted by the rejection of my proposal earlier. However, it is a great honor to be given such a significant responsibility and to know that I am the only one capable of carrying it out. You may leave Sho Chun in our relations with Wu in my hands, if you will excuse me. <laughs> Are you sure about this? Guan Chu Jian was just as popular with the people you know. Jia Chong, I wish you wouldn't verbalize every single concern you have for future disharmony. Master Sima Yi's dying words were not to trust anyone. Have you forgotten that? No. I simply felt that leaving Jugo Dan and Luo Yang was even more dangerous. They say that Guan Chu Jian had a secret missive on him that was sent from Luo Yang. So you suspect that elements encouraging civil unrest may be in Luo Yang, I see? I will investigate the matter. Thank you. Although, I almost dread to learn what you will find. What's the situation, Deng Ai? The Shu forces have secured key locations and are awaiting our response. Their vanguard is led by Shaho Ba. Shaho Ba? Looks like the stories about Shu taking him in were true then. There is no room here to show any mercy because of past attachments. He is too strong to defeat without total commitment. I know. If we're going to do this, we're going to do it right. I know he would expect nothing less. Jian Wei is leading this invasion. If we can take him out, the Shu army should retreat pretty quickly.
I will embark upon my mission. This plan cannot fail to repel the enemy. We will draw the Shu forces as far as Duangu, where we will attack them as one. All forces, be aware of your roles and fight bravely. have been successfully repelled for now. Good. Now I can finally go home. Finally go home. The base has fallen. This is bad. We have to take it back. Yeah. 
reinforcements. We're safe. We must push back against the enemy and slay Shao Ba. Okay, let's get started. I knew reinforcements would be on their way about now. I pretty much know the way Wei does things. Excellent fighting! into our ranks, but this is one territory I refuse to simply hand over. <laughs> for now. This will put an end to our siege weapon assault. That was quite a spectacle. Truly amazing. Good. Now I can finally go home. such as ours shouldn't be left to waste. In order to complete our mission, we will march toward our objective! The Wei forces have pushed us back this far, but it will need more than that to make us retreat. Capturing that area with the fleet their morale. 
Capturing the enemy's bases is the key to defeating them. Now, if you only fought that way in every battle. Alright, I need everyone to defend this area. We will withdraw for now, but this is not a surrender. I will never give up on my desire to bring the Prime Minister's dream to fruition. To be honest, I've got to admire your commitment. But that doesn't mean I can let you get by. I have my pride too, you know. Our mission has ended in success thanks to your timely and perspicacious directives, Master Sima Shao. No. We won because the enemy imploded from within. We won because they decided to attack before replenishing their strength. People make poor decisions when put under pressure. Lord Sima Shao, several Shu soldiers have surrendered to us. What shall we do with them? I see the rats have started to flee the sinking ship. Shu is on its way down. I will meet with some of those who have surrendered. Be careful, Master Zhao. An assassin may be hidden among their number. Stop worrying so much, UNG. I need to find out what's happening in Shu for myself. Tell me, what's happening in Shu these days? Of course, Jiang Wei is still adopting a hardline approach, but he's losing support all the time. Defectors are growing in number. The Shu Emperor simply continues to do as Jiang Wei instructs and sends his people to war. Lord Liu Chen is... I mean, Liu Chen is not fit to carry on the dream of his Lord Father and Lord Zhuge Liang. It's... It's all that fool's fault that Shu is on the verge of ruin. <laughs> <sighs> Master Zhao? Thanks for letting me know. We'll take you in, and anyone else who wants to surrender. Don't worry, we'll treat you well. Thank you so much, my lord. We'd better get back to Luo Yang. Deep in thought, Master Zhao. What is it that troubles you? It seems to me that Shu has lost sight of its former goals, and is now continuing to wage war without good reason. Our intelligence tells us that there are those within the Shu ranks unhappy with this state of affairs. They feel constant war with Wei is draining their kingdom. I am wondering if there is a way we can bring an end to this meaningless conflict. That will not be easy. Wei and Shu have a long history of enmity. But the people who created that history are no longer with us. I think you know it's not that simple, Master Zhao. If only there were someone in the Shu ranks who felt the same way about things as you. Zhao, I have received reports of suspicious movement in Shoshun. Despite the fact that we have no plans to attack U, excessive quantities of provisions and weaponry are being stockpiled within the castle. <sighs> Do you really have to bring me this kind of news at a time like this? <laughs> it will be considerably more bothersome if we allow the situation to fester. Alright, 
I'll pay Jugo Don a visit. Oh, and on the way, I think I'll call by Xu Chang and speak to my brother. Lord Sima Zhao, I bring urgent news. Jugadun of Shochun has betrayed us and has joined forces with U. No! Why now? I just don't understand. Master Zhao, we must send a messenger to Master Jugodun at once and discern his true intent. Yes, you're right. But we must also prepare for war. If we have to fight U, we will need all the men we have. We should request His Majesty join us. Yuan Ji, please go to Zhong Hui. Ask him to convince His Majesty to cooperate with our plans. Very well. The gates to Shoshun are closed. If we wish to organize our forces, Sha Pi is probably the place to do it. Yes. Everyone, head for Sha Pi. By the way, Jia Chong, have you made any progress on identifying the one pulling the strings behind the scenes of these rebellions? <laughs> Wait just a little longer. Zhao, the envoy we sent to Jugo Dun has been executed. What? How could he do that? That's not like him. What's gotten into Jugo Dun? I warned you that Jugo Dun behaves unpredictably when angered. But I see that Wen Qin, who defected to Wu himself, is also in the castle with him. I am sure the two traitors are getting along famously. Jugo Dun's treachery is beyond doubt. There is no need for you to worry anymore on that front, Zhao. I suppose not. I'll have to wait until after we've defeated him to ask him the reason why. All forces! We will launch an attack against Shochun and capture the traitor Jugo Dun! If you're really sure you want to do this, then I have no choice, Jugo Don. All forces advance! We must slay Jugo Don of Shoshun! Chin. I will claim this space and use it as a foothold to seize the enemy main camp. What raw violence! Is there no way to whittle down his resolve a little? Invested once again. Where did I go wrong? 
Amazing! You sure know how to fight! I don't really like defending, but I'll do what needs to be done! The target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. The enemy is very well trained. We must fight with all we've got! Such great strength! I'm pulling back for now. You performed great as always! There was no need for my strategy! Finally go home. Amazing! You sure know how to fight! Reinforcements. This will only strengthen the effectiveness of my plan. I have already sent a fake request for reinforcements to the enemy main camp. Any U forces who emerge will be slaughtered. for our supplies. I'll never allow that.
fought that way in every battle. Okay, let's get go home. Amazing! You sure know it! Reporting. Lord Jui has been attacked and our supplies taken. What? Our supply lines have been severed? This will mean we can no longer remain in the castle. Everyone to defend the 
this area. <laughs> See, my lord? I won't believe this. Try and stop. We have to capture that position, no matter what happens. Doing pretty good, I must say. Okay, let's get started. Sima clan still flows in his veins. And I am but a worthless dog. We've captured Jugo Don. I hope we don't have to go on fighting these meaningless battles forever. I have nothing to say to you. Do not waste my time. Kill me. No. I will have you speak, Jugo Don. You have always been so loyal to Wei. Why did you suddenly turn your back on us? How dare you? You were the one who accused me of treason and sent a spy in to monitor my actions. A spy? What are you talking about? Huh. So you're going to feign ignorance, are you? All of a sudden you're a master of the arts of duplicity. That's not the only reason, anyway. Master Sima Shi brought stability to the land by removing all dangerous elements, even if it meant he had to play the villain. But you... You try and form peace accords with Shu. You reject everything your brother has done. You are not fit to follow in his footsteps! I have heard what you have to say, Jugo Dun. Now you must listen to me. My father and my brother, and Master Cao Pi and Master Cao Cao before them. All they ever wanted was one thing, an end to the chaos. It is my belief that my duty as the leader of Wei is to respect that desire and do all I can to bring it to fruition. But methods will always differ from era to era and from person to person. But if you see only the method and lose sight of the goal, you betray the vision of my father and my brother. And you insult those who have given their lives to support the Kingdom of Wei! <sighs> I... I... I may have been wrong. Jugo Dun, who was it who told you I suspected you of treason? The... That was... That was His Majesty. I... I have been used by the Emperor. But as you say, Master Sima Zhao, the Emperor's methods will not bring an end to this war. Jugo Dun. Master Sima Zhao, you must execute me. 
I have rebelled, and that has cost the lives of many soldiers and innocent civilians. My crime is great. But I ask you, please, can you find it in your heart to spare the lives of the men who served under me and followed my orders? Very well. I will guarantee their safety. I am most grateful. What will you do now, Zhao? You were the one who sent in the spy, weren't you, Jia Chong? You are bothered by his words, that it was the spy who triggered his rebellion. But he and the Emperor were in league long before that. He would have turned his back on us sooner or later. Or perhaps... Perhaps you wish to punish me for intentionally causing him to revolt. No. I don't. I'm going back to Shu Chong. The crime of treason has been borne entirely by Jugo Dun. Wen Qin is already dead. As a result, there will be no punishment for you. Master Sima Zhao, I am most grateful. As am I, my lord. If you would be willing to grant me the honor, I would like nothing more than to fight for you in battle. As would I, my lord. I see. Well, I couldn't be happier to have the services of two such splendid young warriors. I look forward to fighting alongside you, Wen Yang and Wen Hu. My lord! It is an unparalleled honor. It is just as we thought. All of the insurrections were instigated by His Imperial Highness. <laughs> Can you really blame him? Yes. It actually stands to reason. The Sima family are extremely powerful. They have talent, strength, and a lot of experience to back them. Surely, you can see how something like that would look to his Imperial Highness, who has only his lineage. Ah, what a pain! I mean, we've always done all we could for Cao Wei! Ah, yes, honestly, it was done in good faith. And because of that, he killed Cao Shuang and overthrew a corrupt government. And now that is coming back to haunt us. You have become a threat to Cao Mao and a threat to Cao Wei. What will you do, Zhao? Will you just hang your head and watch as it all falls apart before your very eyes? So then. Is this my destiny? My fate? The time has come. To end Cao Wei, we will usher in a new age! Master Sima Zhao, an imperial edict has been issued calling for your death. How does that make you feel? 
I always anticipated it would happen eventually. Looks like they're finally starting to take me seriously. Zhang Hui, I want you to take Deng Ai and Wen Yang and reinforce the border defenses with Xu. I see. Zhang Wei's so predictable. There is no way he won't try and take advantage of this opportunity. You just make sure you keep yourself safe. Yuan Ji, Jia Chong, come with me to Luoyang. <laughs> 